tonight's show is going to be real fun. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. But before we get to that, you know, I want to welcome you to Sex on the Bridge. Yes, with me, the original dance all queen, Carleen. And, you know, bringing you your weekly dose of grown, sexy radio content. Hmm. At 10 p.m. on a Tuesday night, the only place you need to be is the Bridge 99 FM. You can download the app and we can take it from there. And as always, but before I continue, please note this show is rated for adults only. So you under 18s, please take your little titty tattoos and go to your bed. Right? I'm not going to say it again. Don't learn from me and my guests. Go learn from Uno Muma. Yeah. Our pupa, our sister, our brother, but not from us. All right? So that's covered, I hope. Don't want anybody but the children. It's 10 p.m. And I said it. Go to your bed. I also have something great coming up on the 29th of April, which is this Saturday in Plantation Cove. Yes. Priory St. Anog be the same. Murder She Wrote. Of course, you know that song is celebrating 30 years. No, no, no. I'm, I'm younger than that. <laughs> yes, the song is celebrating 30 years. 30 years. One song which still play today and a lot of the young people knows it. So, you know, kudos to Shakadimus and Pliers. Yes. And I, Pliers is the original writer of that song. Yes, actually wrote it in 87. But I'll tell you another time. But there is a bus and a shuttle from Kingston, from St. Anne's, from Montego Bay. The Knoxwood Express can take you to the show. It's an early show. It starts at 7 p.m. with Tanya Stevenson, Leroy Sibliz, um, Richie Spice, Shakademus and Pliers. And if I'm forgetting, and hosted by Tommy Cohen. And of course, Moa would be... Yes, performing. I, you know, I don't sing. So what am I going to do? Dance. All right. You have to come to this. Yes. Trust me. Um, and, and and you have to come see if I still got it, though. <laughs> right? I think I do. But nothing, you know, you don't toot your own on. So come see if I still got it. And as I said, there is a bus leaving from Kingston, St. Anne's and Montego Bay and probably more places would add on to that. But you have no excuse not to come and the bus will take you back the Knoxwood Express. Also, you can get your tickets at all the Fantanos, Kingston, St. Anne, Ochier, wherever Fantanos are. And of course, you can buy your ticket at the gate to come in. But it's always good to pre hold a ticket just in case, you know, the mafia said the gate have a lot because the venue sold out. Okay, so that's April the 29th, this coming Saturday. Yes, we're going to be doing it. It's 30 years. Congratulations, guys. You know, that's a big deal. Also, I want to remind you that I am doing something for my sister for you to asking you to donate to her cancer treatment. So you can go to my page, Dance Whole Queen Carlene on Instagram. Click the link in my bio and you will see the real helping hand. It will tell you how to donate. Uh, I need your help. Yeah. We've been campaigning, but you know, with little more help, it's never too much because we still haven't reached the marking of 50,000 US dollars. I think it's 4,000 something on there. So you see, we do have a long way to go. So each one help one. All right. Nothing is too small and definitely nothing is too big. You know, just come and donate. So Pinky, big up to you. Love you. Soon be home. And, you know, Crystal and Tinman taking care of her right now. So I'm kind of okay. All right. We're done with that. We're going to go into the show. The show tonight. What is my show tonight? Um, does age really matter? We're going to find out, right? We're going to find out from my guest in studio. With me, I have my very good friend, for long time, can we not age yourself right, Christine? Right. I have the first female promoter out of Toronto, Canada, Christine Jackson. We go. <laughs> I, I have over to the far right. Yes, I know him as Tall Man. <laughs> he might have other names. Yeah. Big, big, big promoter, producer, manager. Yes. Name it. He got it. Now, an orange <laughs> farmer. Yeah. yeah. I tell him orange, <laughs> them sweet. Yes, I support my, my own. Yeah. 
Welcome, Talman. Thank you for having me. And in the far, far right, I have CJ Jackson, mm -hmm. upcoming big, big dancer, mm -hmm. right? Big up actor and dancer from actor, Toronto. Actor, dancer from Toronto, And right. social media influencer. Yes. All right. So, yeah, we have a, a whole, you know, we have some oldies but goodies. Yeah. And then a young, young in. All right. So, we're going to hear, <laughs> you're gonna hear how, how and where and why and what and, That's you know, right. how it's done. But as always... We do it on the bridge, on the bridge 99, and of course, sex on the bridge with me differently. So to get the mood, you know, going and get the studio hot and warm and, you know, my guests flowing and the juices can pop up to all of the nice, juicy sex, sex, sex things that they have in store in the basket. Some have cobweb, some are broom, <coughs> and some is just <laughs> shooting like a... Planting, we're ready for dead, right? So we have all kind of, you know, characters in here that will tell you how, you know, how it's going, why they did what they did way back then for Christine, especially. <laughs> Talman's still on the verge, yeah. but you know, a lot of the things he did was way back then, right? <laughs> oh, it's okay. <laughs> it's today work, right? It's still all right. We're gonna not know. Not change. Not not change. All right. <laughs> not drop. Not catch. Not drop. Not catch. Tom would say. So we're gonna find out a lot more from them. You know how it's done. But never read no script tonight, my dear. We just come in excited to see Christine, who I haven't seen in about twenty, twenty or more years. There you go. Long we time. speak though. We speak and yeah. thank God for technology. Amen. We right. video call. We chat. We mm -hmm. trot yourself to sleep. <laughs> we wake up and we pick up the conversation. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And I want to big up Kevin Jacks. CJ. Ke no, I want to big up Kevin in Toronto. Pumpkin. Kevin Brooks. I was going to say Jackson because he <laughs> just said his name. <laughs> Kevin, don't kill me. Big up Kevin Brooks. Yes. My <coughs> boss. Kevin, my brother. I have a grudge to pick with him, but I'll wait till I see him. <laughs> right? Big up. Real, 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 real man. Yeah. You know? A he heart of a gold. Yeah. Um, somebody who is a good friend to have. Yeah. Trust me. I don't know about the husband or the baby father status. <laughs> no, I'm baby father to man. No, to have. Mm. So I don't know because mm. one of the baby mothers, two of them want to kill him. So, <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know. But as a human being and a humanitarian in his own right, He's caring, a caring, caring. Yeah, so me. Kevin, please don't change. All right, pumpkin, don't change. All right, we're going into we're going into our little fun segment. What did I miss? Did I miss anything? No. All right. So we're going to play some games. So slow wine, of course. Slow wine to the thing. Them two no one drunk, so them send water to their thing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, Christine probably will take the first little shot. Come in, no, she now miss nothing. So the glass will be still there. Mm -hmm. Give that to CJ. What What is my topic? Me, you see me and them last year, now working on, now work. <laughs> All right, the category is what is the okay, category? Let's go. What? All right, so the category is no, no during sex. So the, these things in sex just not acceptable. So I'll start. No farting. No farting. No, no. you have to say something else. No laughing. <laughs> right. <laughs> Crying either. No picking off the fingernails. Nice. <laughs> No talking on the phone. Right? Definitely no picking <laughs> off the nose. Oh, yeah. Definitely. You have to. And next. Um, <laughs> no digging out your ears. All right. <laughs> next. No watching off the TV. Okay. Catch it just before. <laughs> yeah. Next. <laughs> Drink. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> give, him this one. Don't give him this one. It's too late. <laughs> Take too long. <laughs> Mm -hmm. So your turn. The category is a year to say a category. Um, what do you do before you start making love? Huh? What would you foreplay? do? Foreplay. Yeah. What? Wh For, what yeah. That's what one. Would you that's foreplay? category is foreplay. So come on. Yeah. You have to give a. You have to start. I have to give an answer. Yeah. Music. Yeah. Your turn, Talma. Running fingers through the ears. 
making out sucking of the nipples oh wow. blowing in the ears singing a little soft sexy song sucking on the neck definitely <laughs> slapping on the butt um caressing of the <laughs> breasts no 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 you have to drink i said breasts already so <laughs> yeah. it takes too long so drink your water, <laughs> water so category man. is so you start what's um, the category uh you have to drink it take too long what that me yes <laughs> <laughs> no but no okay i need you have to give me a little more time right, that come again. The it, category it, is it, it's oh, we have no way to talk about sex you know so we can't rush <laughs> the thing you have to take your time you have with to the have game a, we are rush you no we can't rush it think, we can't rush it everything true yeah but then we're not going to get through the night if uh, everybody thinks what okay. are the do's during sex okay so tell us one um Kissing off the neck. Sucking on the nipple. Somebody said that already. No, that's in a different category. Okay, okay. Going okay. down on me. <laughs> You're um, <laughs> Come closer to the mic. Um, Drink again, Christine. <laughs> <laughs> it's been so long. <laughs> I know. No. Category is um, talking to Mike. Drink. Yeah, it takes a lot. You're supposed to drink one shot. Have glass over there. <laughs> yeah, so I'm um, um, cheating the game already, Carly. So no, it's all right. Fill this one up. <laughs> Fill this one up here. Carly, what is one your name, Carly? Slow wine, and Whoa. this is the June plum thing. You want to just taste it? It's really good. No, they, oh, they, okay. um, it tastes nice. You don't have to drink. If 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 me drink this wine <laughs> tonight, it's problem. <laughs> and so you know, I'm not in the bed. Um, all right we'll hold the answer <laughs> <laughs> all right the yeah. category is position back shot lizard lap i know that one mm-hmm. foot pan shoulder wheelbarrow <laughs> mommy and daddy <laughs> drink <laughs> <laughs> drink <laughs> your turn your turn again now so the category is one more time this is our last time going around category is um what not to do you did that already, did that so already. Drink. you really should be drinking for <laughs> your <gone> the <laughs> yeah, it just makes it just drink right you <laughs> listen not <laughs> hearing nothing okay what how to turn on your man i hearing nothing you hear it now yeah how to turn on your partner so see you have to say exactly what slap him in the head back <laughs> 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 what, what kind of sleeping partner? Yeah, because some man get bored and slap him one time. All right. Mommy, you sound rough. <laughs> yeah. Producer, I mean, if you agree with me, but she, she too rough. <laughs> You're next. That, me? Yes. Um, Play with her hand middle. <laughs> like a thigh feel up. Take a what? A thigh feel up. A thigh feel up. Put on something sexy and slowly take it off. Um, okay. Uh, lingerie. Oh. In no, because I just said put on something sexy and take it out. So you have to go drink the yeah. whole bottle of water now. All right, so we get the drift of the the show, yes. the, the game. And Christine, if there was a loser's point, you got it. That, <laughs> that only tell you how hard up she is, guys. <laughs> Don't judge her. <laughs> Don't judge her. Don't knock her free. Carlin, let yeah. me explain something before you continue the show. <laughs> Looks at the CV here. Yeah? Yeah. Don't no, no, judge no, She's moment. dried up. No, I didn't say she's. Yeah, it's Ooh. about four or five years. Nobody touch mm-hmm. her. Yeah. That's what she tell you. No, Are that's you I think? know that. Are you yes. As they would say, <laughs> la da di, da da la da da. da. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on there. What you know about her? What I don't know. <laughs> no, no, I don't know. I don't know much about her. You know, based on when I came into the studio, she was walking and you know she seemed pretty active and. Yeah. Then she uh, is, she, she look like she's ready to go right now. She is. Then five years. Okay. You think you're getting a lick yet? You think she's rough yet? Murder she wrote. Murder she real. Yeah, murder she wrote when she catch what she catch. Is it by choice though? That's the next thing. It is. Okay. It yeah, for really is. Go back. Go. Go, sir. Yeah, right in. It, it is. It, yeah. it is literally 
by choice because um, you just like in my situation, you know, more run to a man for comfort. I didn't do that. I stayed in my own. She oh, run from. From, yeah. Thanks well. to the ex husband, she run from. Well. Yep. We had and story hopefully, gets sweet. <laughs> you will understand what I'm I, 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 I might, I might um, give her some counseling after the show. I might All need right. it. <laughs> <laughs> she said she might need it. <laughs> Just constant, yeah, mommy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm not that kind of a man. I'm not a one night stand. So if I um, see him, town man, me know you know, in This town man was really a real big time girl, you know. Still is. You, no, you see? life change. Oh, life really? change. Oh, yeah, I'm life proud change. of you. Nice, nice, I'm nice. proud when, of you. When you reach to a stage, yeah, sometimes you have to sit back and look yeah. and say, Wow. I like me have that. a mother, me have sisters. Even though other them might may have nieces, may have some sisters, and I can't see them are real close. Yes. So, you know, you have daughters? No, I'm not getting a daughter. Oh, but I have a daughter, but I can't see them a daughter. Okay, that's no, why. I don't want a man to them feed that. So, I yes. try to remember say, the woman in my life as somebody mother, as yes. somebody daughter, as somebody this. So, my sure. days I've taken a man for clown and puppy show. Learn done, procedure, listen. It's done a long time. That's All of this come with maturity and. I get some hurt to you, so I said, I just can't take no more, so. Man can't get hurt badly? Of course. Yeah, you but some of them afraid for talk. Yeah. yeah. And and commit suicide, or I think the, yeah. the men... Men are, men are reach a stage. No, yeah. not you, not you. <laughs> I just explained it, because she said, man can get hurt, and that's why the suicide rate sometimes is so higher, because they don't talk about it. So we will go tell our friend. I think you can go just tell, especially in Jamaica, say... I said, she, my man, girl clone and girl mascot, and yeah, so they tend to keep it to themselves. Yeah. Well, you know, uh, no, we have to be realistic and we have to be truthful. Every man, sometime in their life, even at an early stage or a late stage, is a clone. <laughs> and every woman at some stage in her life, she is or every was a clone. Most. Oh. Yeah. Because I'd say, say most. Yeah, most, most yeah. yeah. On both sides of the coin. Yeah, both. Because yeah. nothing is 100. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. It wasn't. Not right. even the DNA. Because it's 99. No, my, point DNA, point. I feel my DNA, my DNA, I feel sure. Well, Never trademark, you know. You see my finger, them? Them have a little bend. So, when my son, them born, the first thing I look on, are the finger, them. What then what if it's it, it, it yeah. not bent, but yeah. it come out to prove that it is. No, well, you know what I mean? I never have no doubts in my situation because I never really lay myself careless. No, no, no. I'm just, I was just saying nothing is 100% where yeah. up to a day is 99.1. So there's oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we can accept that, 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 yeah. Yes, I was just stating not that no, money. No, I was just saying <laughs> that nothing is 100%. I was just saying that nothing is 100%. The listeners don't might start calling too early because this DNA thing is a Jamaica problem. So leave it alone, Carly. Yeah, because that's yeah. another topic anyway. Yeah. Because well, Save like, it for another some show. Some of them gally I wanna wicked in the wicked in the wicked. I know a couple of them will do it and mm-hmm. it's not mm-hmm. nice. Look here, there is a case that's just going on five pitney and the man stop at the four. He doesn't even want to do the last child's DNA. Not one is mm-hmm. it. Well, not not one is is. That's crazy. Got that's crazy. Mm-hmm. When I'm just bringing the DNA, DNA that's test. That's one of the things that and mess And I send for him five kids. And the DNA come back. And one of them out of the five are female. Well, he's lucky that he got one. Because a lot of people are getting none. Mm. Absolutely none. <laughs> and that never know. US Embassy want to do this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even think Canada Embassy is doing much of that. No, man. I'm going to do it too, man. Yeah. Yeah, because you know people will come through and the kids is not the man, but them still get the visa and come. Well, if you claim this is not your child and unlike it's a stepchild or adopted child or whatever, you're okay. It's when you're saying this is your biological. Yeah, this is the problem coming. And in. the thing come back saying, <laughs> not That's you. That's why them know them have a Christian institution now, you know, that is doing the DNA testing for Very the free. U.S. Embassy. No, it has to go oh. through one of the um, private hospitals. Okay. Yeah, no mm. public entity in Jamaica does DNA testing for the U.S. Embassy no more. All right. Anyways, I shouldn't bring in that, but we're done with <laughs> it because tonight our topic is not about DNA, mm. as you see, touchy. <laughs> 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 right. Tonight it's about dating. Does age matter? Mm-hmm. Does 
you know, we know size matter, but does age matter? And we're going to learn from my panelists if it does and who likes it younger or older. Sometimes we tend to judge a woman who dates a younger man. But a man who dates a younger woman, it's fine. So you'll see a 45-year-old man with an 18-year-old girl and that's, he's a stud. You see a 45-year-old woman with an 18-year-old man and she's a pedophile. You know, unfortunately, no, cougar comes when it's older, 25 and up. So cougar is accepted. But once she's in the teen, Mm -hmm. he's in the teen, he's like, met the people in Pitney Grove. But with the girl, oh, it's a sugar daddy or, you know, something is there. And it's quite, they get married and it's okay. With the man, the boy, he's called a boy. And that the woman is looking for a son and, you know, all mm-hmm. kind of things. It's always not fair on the lady's side versus the man's side, which I kind of, I personally feel both is not right. But it depends on circumstances. <laughs> it depends on how um, a woman gets involved with an older man. I My specialty is that I love older men. From yeah, I... I don't find like there's no way I could see a man in his teen <coughs> or even up to probably 35 attractive. That's just me. I don't find that attractive. I don't. So would you date a man nine years younger, eight years younger than you? Yeah, probably. Yeah, up to 10 years probably. Hmm. Well, I did and it didn't work out. You dated at 10 years. Until I got no, married not, to that I'm, one. I'm not saying it's going to work. I'm just saying what I, I might try is a 10-year gap. Mark, you make me know my personality. Me go bully him. Um, <laughs> well, uh, you know what? Honestly speaking, come like to keep it real. I think maybe I did a bit of that in my relationship too. Because two older, older yeah. than him. But at the end of the day, age is just a number and... It really shouldn't matter in a relationship, right? Mm, uh, from your, you're a big man. From your reach, what? No, but you see, with men, you know, men are far <laughs> younger in their thinking than women are. We're way more mature. So a, a 35-year-old woman and a 35-year-old man is day and night. So you have a 35-year-old man and a um, woman and a 25-year-old man. It's day and night. It's hard for it to work. The that reverse when the man is right, always Kali, older. Let mm-hmm. me let me interrupt you sure. real quick. Um, you see, our Jamaican society, mm-hmm. we tend to look at things from different angles, and sometimes we tend to not be honest in our in our opinions. Mm-hmm. Um, when when a older when a younger girl looks to be in a relationship with an older man, most of the time. The, the average person says she look a sugar daddy or she look a right. boop as what they would true. call it right yeah. sometimes it's based on upbringing where she's looking for more than one character in this particular person mm-hmm. she's looking for financial security yeah. one. she's looking for a father figure mm-hmm. in enough situations um and in some cases, she's looking somebody where she can be more of the dominant person in the relationship. Or or she just wants somebody who's going to put her on a pedestal. Right. And worship the ground she walks on based on that's what an older man does. I yeah. can tell yeah. you from and experience. And, and, and then, and you then know, sometimes she's not looking for any of the above. Mm-hmm. It's just True. that knowledge gives wisdom. And if you're somebody who have the yearning for knowledge, True. you always know an older person is going to teach you. Mm-hmm. And so the attraction of an older man's mind, which was my view, you know, talking to the guys my age group back then, them giddy, in my opinion. I'm, I'm yeah, come with me, I got school. Me, um, <laughs> the girls I got my high school at the time, they're not really talk to school guys right no so well, as like you 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 stated out some of the reason but i'm telling you mine okay. was that i was more into being taught you okay. know i had no my dad took care of me so i didn't need money and none of the dramas that come with it i never had fathers 
father issue and i yeah. definitely didn't want a man that looked like my father <laughs> or was like my father because that i just wanted knowledge i just wanted somebody who would make sure i didn't do the wrong things yeah. okay. i wanted somebody who was gonna okay. say okay of course and hopefully <laughs> teach me about sex you know mm -hmm. more in depth you know teach me how to keep my body clean you know because you're young you're young and you, it's not something just brought onto you especially when you didn't have a mother so people misunderstand yeah. that you're looking a father. No, I'm looking knowledge. So I just know that I didn't want a baby. And me not understand how the baby really don't come. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm <laughs> hoping that he's going to guide me and say, okay, you know, we we'll have to go get the contraceptive, which he did. And understood where I wanted to go with my life and was guiding me on that mm -hmm. level. So it doesn't necessarily have to be people just call it sugar daddy. You know, that is true because a lot of females, in, uh, like when I was in high school, they always used to go for older guys. So that makes sense what you're saying. Right. Mm -hmm. It's it sometimes has nothing but the perspective of the of persons out there is that she want a sugar daddy. <laughs> you know, they immediately look. Somebody men up with flow with flow and caramel daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Especially if all the men go ugly <laughs> and big and fat and ugly, you know, they start to say, What could she be doing with him? They run into the wrong yeah, sugar so daddy. Yeah. Yeah. And <laughs> in the reverse, where now them see this good looking young boy with his old crush up woman, yes, and I'm my money, I'm out. And it could be in the same breath that he wants to learn. <laughs> yeah, uh, most of the time, <laughs> the, the, the first impression or the first thing will come to your mind. Sometimes I say, Because if we go, we go say we go Negro and we and we see a young like a Jamaican youth with a a, a colored a white woman. Uh, yeah, white woman. <laughs> 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 the first thing you come to mind, you yes, say uh, visa. I'm looking at yeah, visa. because yeah. we were we. You over and over. We look away out. Yeah, and over and over it's told to us like that. While because in Negro the there is <laughs> mostly white poor people there. Yeah. Him not have much choice of woman more than catch one where come and from and far. And then you see what now again do you see? You see sometimes. A man, you, we see a, a older man with a younger woman. The first thing, you know, is like him. I said, boy, him, 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 him never get when forget at the right time. So, <laughs> him, I go so back to. So, I'm going to get it now. Some of them special treatment too, though. Yeah, the, the young one, I'm going to make him feel good and she I give him all the position. Then where all right, hold that position. <laughs> hold that position. <laughs> We're going to take a break from Sex on the Bridge. I'll be right back. Welcome back to Sex on the Bridge and that super cat. Yes, it boops the go on your remote. <laughs> I remember that song back in the days. Anyways, welcome back to Sex on the Bridge, guys. And to be a part of the show, you can send me a voice note, 876-551-5782. Or you can call in 876 676 Four nine nine six, or you can also follow the bridge on social media, including YouTube, and you can watch all your favorite SOB series that pass, and of course, when the new one comes, yes, and you know to follow me, Dan Talking Carlene, on Instagram and and TikTok. Yeah, I'm on TikTok. I'm so excited. I'm on TikTok. <laughs> it's Dan Talking Carlene on TikTok also. All right, so we're gonna go back in studio with me. I have Christine Jackson, promoter. Hello. Slash humanitarian slash friend slash sister. I do have tall man in there slash everything slash and little TJ slash two things. Oh, you just <laughs> emphasize on the little <laughs> TJ. Like. He's a baby. He's a baby amongst the... the, the, the th okay, yeah. okay. No, man, in my 20-something. Yeah, young picnic. Yeah. No, the I don't know nothing. It's, that's it. It's her nephew and my little friend. Mm -hmm. And we won't him. push yeah. him, you know, but... Oh, mm. you teach him, that's why you're Easier here. to learn from you. get a older woman to teach him. You yes, he beat him as an older woman. Ah, you think he's uh, easy. Uh, uh, yeah, you uh, think he's here tonight. CJ. You, see, you, don't, you don't know <laughs> now I get involved in that, that sound <laughs> political. <laughs> I leave that alone. <laughs> real politics is now. Yeah, we can be a part of this conversation. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to start with you. First of all, what attracted you to this younger man? The way he treated me. Go, talking to the mic. The way I'm treating me? I mean. No, you have to give me something. Alright. I'm going to kick Alright, for my situation. No, the first. The f no, the first attraction. 
So remember, you could have come in here and see this man and trim tall, dark, and handsome. <laughs> what was your first attraction? All right. I'm used to certain kind of man, right, Colleen? Like, can I say it? Yes. I'm used to gunman, bad man, drugs dealer, straight like that. Right. And this <laughs> man was the opposite. This man was a working man. Like, I wanted to get out of the world there. And I'm this man cute and mm, in, the, in a world, he's like the opposite. That's so the first so is this thing. So his appearance you, you were attracted to? N no, no. He looked like a countryman, but he was just <laughs> simple. <laughs> yeah, he never ugly and I'm feared, but right, that's just a, appearance. Sorry, wh what attracted you is that he looked nice and you knew his background? Yeah, his background was legit. What? It wasn't the world I was in. Right. So, so I wanted that's the what opposite. attracted you to yeah, him? Yeah, I think that's really what caught my eyes first. All right. What's the youngest age from you you've ever dated? I'm 48. Huh? Yeah. No, 10 years? About that. So that's it. You, you've never gone 15 or 20 no, years sir. ago? <laughs> no, no, no. All right. No, no never. <laughs> so I'm going to ask Talman. Let me hear the one here. So he likes younger women. Mm. What's the youngest you've dated? So we understand. If you're being truthful, if uh, you want. No, to. no, 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 right. no, no, no. It's it, it, this show is all about the truth. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, and the kids not listen. No. Hopefully, so no. we have to be. No kids very, not listening. Yeah, all um, eighteen and over. I don't go below thirty, you know. Thirty. So can I ask how old you are? Maybe, maybe. Fifty. Fifty. No. Fifty. Little. Little. Little before that. You reach fifty. No. Oh, so you're in forties. Yeah. So. 19 years so you no no may i said the youngest i've ever been was, was 30. right how much year is younger 30 years different no this at, at the time at, at, at that time the person was like um at the time when i was involved with that person it was probably like 10 years older you were 10 years older yeah no so i want to know what's your youngest oldest you've been for somebody the youngest girl you've dated not in our age number the, the age difference from you we don't need to know oh 10 10 10 years, ten years? Yeah. oh so it's not a 20 years no sir we can't bother that i mean i'm the senior citizen and the school teacher <laughs> no, no, no 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 i'm asking the girl young you I mean, understand what right, but so i'm saying only 10 years younger <laughs> yeah that's, that's not, not yeah that's normal yeah. Well, one, long, that one <laughs> long time me reach on uh, me can only go on 15 20 one time like and you are 20 years older than her yeah at the time okay how what well, you want me to know it's it like she just put herself on me and it's like i couldn't resist god <laughs> me have to resist you know <laughs> me have okay to resist. what attracted you to her Phys physical attributes no what Big titty, little body. What? Nice shape. I like women with nice shape. I like women with real hair. Real hair. I don't go for the... I'm, I'm not against it, but I don't go for the make body. The yeah. what? The make, the, the, the body that go to um, the foreign yeah, country. The designer bodies. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so what happens if you see a girl mm. and you like her? And then after sh she went, she has a designer body. You're not going to be with her? No, those are things that we're going to discuss at the beginning of the relationship. If you feel uncomfortable within your own skin. So, no, now I'm asking you. So, she come to you and say, my bottom fake. I did a tummy tuck or whatever. No, me I go find out all of that, you know. No, that's what I'm saying. So, you look her because she looks nice. Yeah. Remember, it's not everybody. No, Remember, well, if me, fa my if, if, is fake. if when we reach, if when we reach come to on, that point. People say my breast is fake. My breast isn't fake. Okay. So you looking at me might say I'm not gonna talk to her because she has fake breasts. Because okay. you don't like fake breasts. No, Just no, no. saying my breasts real. If 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 when me find out say you're fake, me gone. Why? Why? Just wanna understand why Um There are certain things that you, you you need to discuss with your partner at the no, beginning of the No, But if you see the girl and she's already done, they say I'm nothing to do with you. This is how you've seen her. But may I forgive and take here, yes, sir. May I forgive and take Ca them say well you don't know, you just don't know. Exactly. Yeah, but now I'm gonna know. But now I'm gonna know say that girl about time I read and her breast fake I may may attract it to that. 
if me find out something real are you done involved and you already like no me not, me not me not easy for get involved me not no, no, one no. night Maybe standing up no man just, just get me saying up me you're, not that man a you man just get her. me so you're to go grand. walk and say them but they would tell boss no 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 my thing kind of different listen you sleep with her because you're attracted to her you pick her up in the night and on a gold couple nights mm-hmm. and you pick her up and you sleep with her back in the days and these things weren't real you're not going to talk <laughs> to her back because they're not real no 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 i, w- I, I definitely gonna we're gonna discuss this well you're gonna discuss she you take them out no, but she can't take out nothing then. Me have exactly, to so just discuss. Me have to just accept it. Exactly. Yeah, me have to just accept it and say, like yeah. Her, I understand know. what you're trying to say. Yeah. You're not going to go to a direct looking fake body. No, I'm not going to do that. But I if, understand. If I don't know and I get involved, right. me have to just live with it. Yeah, because right. what yeah. you're going to do? Tell her to take them out? No, sir. So and that, a deflated that bottom. That's going to cost me. I mean, that's going to cost. In the long run. Yeah, so. Well, you know. All right, CJ. This is your brother. You're this one here. <laughs> <laughs> From a younger point of view, make clear. All right. Normally, I'm into the younger females, but I'm recently talking to a female that's five years older, and I can see the difference. I like that they're more responsible and they have their stuff together. All right. What made you was attracted to her? Personality, because personality is key. So for me. hold on. You can't see personality. So, what made you were attracted to her? It was just a connection. You can't see personality. So, if I look, if I look at her in there, I, I can say, "Rotted." I like the thing on her head. Right, right, right. The shape, the shape. Our shape. The shape. Mm. What shape? What kind of shape she have? Because I like girls with like a bigger butt. I don't really care for the upper, but like as long as they have a lower, like the lower is nice, I'm good with that. Mm. So. She have the big butt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you not care if it's real or fake. No, 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 I like the real, natural. Oh, oh, <laughs> Jesus. So that's 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 just me. That's just me, though. <laughs> no, that's and yeah. see, it's Aries. It's a, a senior to you is saying the same thing. Mm-hmm. I mean, some natural. men don't care, and are you never right? Yes. Yeah, in my old back, <laughs> auntie is here. <laughs> Don't do it, man. Okay. Now this auntie right. are rubble. <laughs> all right. You all give my girl, yeah. All right, I'm if I'm single, <laughs> oh, so you you like now from talking to the girls at your age group and younger. This older girl is more mature, mm-hmm. and so what? You enjoy this? Uh, th- that's what I like a lot about her. I feel like we don't argue as much as the younger girl. the younger ones that I've experienced with. She has like her life together. Like she has her goals. Yeah. She has her own house. I just like that it's just put together. Cause mm. some like some females that I've just been talking to that are younger, they're almost like lost. Like they don't really know where they're going. Some of them don't even have money. You know, some females that just want to live off their man. I don't really agree with that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, cause again, he's Canadian. You know, each culture different. <laughs> <laughs> he can tell you back in the, especially when we were younger, it's a man responsibility to take care of his woman. Mm. It's our Jamaican culture back then. I think mm. it's changed a lot. Where even if she had her own, it was his responsibility. Mm. He can tell you on duty to make sure a female woman was taken care of by him. Yeah. So in that way, she's covered. She don't need nothing from no other man. If she take her next man, she does bad. But I agree with that as well. Oh, okay. But some of them, they just want to just live off the man and then just want to stay home, don't do nothing. Oh, no, that's, work. that's that's what Love I don't like. That's how a lot of the Canadian girls out there are. Yeah, this was also yeah. so in Jamaica. <laughs> you can go to Dan seven days a week and have no work. Yes, think about it, Christine. <laughs> Who has a job that goes to a party that finish at 7 a.m.? Right. Thank you, yo. Let's be real. But they think so going to the party as a job. That's it. Go to figure look man Mm -hmm. right so a lot of girls is just that this generation your kind has a different perspective on the things they want yeah so it's all about designing this designing that that. and to go to every pan that lick (laughs) knock party that's keeping Mm -hmm. then they're going and as you're saying they don't have a job and i feel like they're rich but they don't even have ten dollars in their account exactly to do anything for it and they 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 so i understand so you prefer the older girl based on that you know she has her head on our body Mm -hmm. she knows where she's going and then you could guide 
she could guide you to understand where you should go. Yeah. And mm-hmm. we take care of each other. So it's not each just like other. a one person right. just taking care because of you. Because know, next thing them think you yeah, look woman for mine. Exactly. You, not you right know? Mm. No, it's a lot wrong with that. So you don't want a woman for mine. You want to to, to be together, together, yeah, together to build together. Because okay. remember, you know, Smart. woman for mine, man, you know, going to give you no hell, you know. Hey. Yeah, I'm not talking to you. Some we are expect you to do certain Very things. And my just clone, like men you know. that mind women. There's a price tag on that too. Both ways. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's just that but you don't want to accept it. You want my, a woman to take care of you and you want to talk back to her. All of my life, me take care of woman. Me this new age, I feel like who wants somebody to take care of you now? Not necessarily, because it comes sometimes with some pressure. Them talk to you a certain way. Them expect you to do certain things. But just need a woman that is going to be there for me, and I'm right, there and for grow her. Right, with her. So yeah. what if you're there? What if she's Talking there for you? Like. What if that lady is there for you, and you know in your heart, say, yo, I have Mary around the corner the same way, you know, and... No, I pass that stage in my life, you know. Some, I can't as talk old to nobody. as you might be, yeah. I don't think I'm pass that stage. A lot no, of me, men, me no pass he's that. telling you he's done with that. No, I'm done with that. Why am I done, done with that? teach some man that? Them two lie. Because you want me to know. I just get up. All right. I have a son. How old? Um, He's 25 years old. Oh, like you. Okay. He, 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 he has a daughter. She was born last October. I'm going to say to him one day, I'm my reason. I'm going to say to him, say, one girl you have him, I say, yeah, dad. Smart kid. I'm going to say, why that? No, no, I see what like a one girl, I'm going to say, you the reason. I say, me? What me have to do with that? I'm going say, I see what you put mom through in, 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 in my early years. So, I don't, I don't want to put my girl through this. Good so, I'm just the same girlfriend from high school to college, yeah. right through. So, when we look back and listen my son, I, I read him upon a level of my first, you know, so. But done with this. If you didn't know. Okay. Yeah, so. But it's but it's a try to do the right thing at this Which age. Is the right you know, gotta yeah. a good man. You get the right perfect. Yeah, me feel like me go find you're a good man it. right now. You're ready for it. Mm-hmm. Ready All right, right, we're gonna now. listen to a voice note and then we can talk on it. So hi guys. So for me dating a an older man, at one point I felt like I had daddy issues to be honest with you. But um, separate and apart of that, I think I like somebody who is, I guess, more experienced and somebody who is uh, more mature. And I have found that maturity in older men, um, they seem to understand me on a whole because I think that I have an old spirit. I am that type that loves to cook, wash, clean. Not saying that I'm going to do it for them because obviously they must be attached but um but just the the conversation line and i in a sense i do not have to ask for things they understand exactly what a relationship is supposed to be like and so i have always found it easier to date um older men and when i say older men i like men at least like you know 15 to 20 years older (laughs) Uh, yes yes she made valid points right Mm -hmm. but let me tell you young lady i hope you're listening is the worst feeling when you got this 15 to 20 year old man and he's acting like he's younger than you and don't think you have any needs don't know your needs (laughs) it's the worst thing because you don't expect that from older people period need a old a young guy take a older woman she is expecting her to be a mother figure to him although he's not his mother a young girl take you heard her point she thinks he's he knows her needs and fulfill them we have another one all right so first of all i view that age is just a number when they say older you know, everybody say when they're older you got to be a little more mature um but sometimes you meet somebody who is younger who is much more organized than yourself so they're much more mature so it's all about the individual and maybe how they were grown up um for dating older so i did feel like there were aspects which i needed to work on or improve upon younger thing it 
things are a little easier they don't want as much or the expectations are not as high all are looking for yeah man we we'll live together marriage type of thing i don't have much time left uh, <laughs> wow. all right so and he's probably correct because you're older you understand what you've been through you know what you've you don't want to go back through let's be real no me and she older why am i going to want to go back over this i'm dating you after x time and it's only for sex mm -hmm. and then you decide you find somebody else who's younger and just want sex what happened to me yeah. let's be real no. i don't have that time to waste waste of time yeah mm -hmm. same thing with an older man he might be easier to get a younger girl once he has a car because you know the the chicken heads and the other heads mm -hmm. out there with a woman oh, yeah, she, them name now. oh yeah, yeah. Man. <laughs> <laughs> with a woman she better have some money now for go pay for one younger man so you're dating a guy as he's saying she wants more yeah because how much sex you think is going to be um, enough Carly, let me just make a valid yes. point here you have some younger females that have some so much of a mature mind of course that yes. was believe me in terms of knowing what you is want. required of yes. them in a relationship yes, you'll be wash so, and clean. so yeah and, and that is and you see Not sometimes sometimes jamaican like men we, we just have this thing they say well if a woman can cook wash and clean men are want her. that I'm Th gonna, those are those are that's cultural difference yeah those are because things that come with, with money, relationship people with money don't have that thinking because yeah. as I tell you, I was dating an older man and we had two helper. It wouldn't mind me to stay in a G string all day or no string. So it depends on yeah, the so background you're coming from. We're coming from, from right. Yeah. So wash, clean, cook, yeah, clean. I know you want me to you know. want a woman who just like a get up, wash, cook, and clean every day, sir. So? Yeah. And then she'll wash right. now. I mean, lay down in a bed, I watch um, okay. Arsenal, I get six love. Sure. Me can't yeah. deal with that. Me have to help her. Put the white clothes them in a one section mm -hmm. and the color and help her do the little thing them and help her greater the coconut and oh gosh yeah. you know them little thing so me, me, me come from old old school me not, me not, where me it not. should be both ways yeah, yeah it's, it's a 50 like 50 yeah. yeah i don't feel like you, but you no, know, realize, enjoy it then it's a different fine thing. Yeah. realize don't say women up on sundays i request that men cook especially if them can cook yeah it shouldn't be as we've left that day and age where yeah, man, you know why, why a lot of things were like that remember the woman never worked true so let's be real you yeah. them yeah, so right, let's Carly. be real you them woman all the for come, come, come cook well, what kind of relationship that? Couple yeah, that. I mean, uh, it, sh it should be her instinct the exactly. man down the bread the yep. way look the bread mm -hmm. You She's the least you can do is take cook. care of exactly. the house yeah. and give him liquor dinner. Mm -hmm. The man's home. working, paying all the bills. No, why it's different? Everybody, I'll know a woman I work with the man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> In that situation, all right, you made a very valid point. Suppose it is the man that stays home and the woman goes out. Of don't matter. So you if they post a wash, cook and clean. Yeah. Okay. Because come on, she. You can imagine she go work. Engineer, you hear that? Yeah. But I'm then cool. it's okay. She gone to work <laughs> and you does the woman lay down for the woman you come know? back home. No, 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 no. Me not say nothing wrong. But you me see the engineer look a little surprised. Me does I wonder if him <laughs> agree or him disagree. No? Yeah, <laughs> he would. He you can, agree. He he can't disagree or agree because he's a working man, so he doesn't mm. know the other side. Okay. Yeah, a man who see, goes see to the work. See the look when yeah, a man who goes to work <laughs> can. I mean, if he wants, remember, you know, some woman can't cook. Yeah, so that our next wash, cook and clean, <laughs> and a man don't mind. So he will leave work and come home and do it. You have some men. No, men have that in me. Too much work to be honest. Have that that's me. Too much work. That's us. You know, that's us. Yeah, go. I, I don't want him help me. Talk to the mic. I I would like him to help me because if he's home and I'm coming home from work, the two we are going to the kitchen. No, I'm me not going to no kitchen if me I come home from work and he's yeah, on my day. Me not going to the kitchen no, with him. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm not. going it with him. Mm -mm. Yeah, mm -mm. I'm not going to teach him what to do. Unless it's, it's and as you say, unless you want to. But mm. knowing me, 
Because I already don't want to go in the kitchen. I'm, I'm going to work. <laughs> it's too it's good for a connection time now and then. But yeah. if you're this late. On a lame, Sunday, as, exactly. as, as, as Talman said, on a Sunday mm. when, you know, it's the day off for most people and you want to spend some quality time. Quality well, time, I don't want yeah. to, we can't tell on no, the ladies do not spoil on a man them because what the next day they're going to benefit tell from Tell me it. what you mean by that. Don't spoil me, spoil what the does, boy. Yeah, what does spoil me? All right, Sunday, me and him would cook, me not lie. Saturday, I'm cooking your soup. Right on Monday, right back at me. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner, yeah, I get. Yeah, I get your, your breakfast, your lunch, you work on, you come home, dinner prepared. I, I, I did everything the right way. Don't do it. So what happened? If, 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 if you <laughs> thought you did it the right way, what happened? He, he was living a double life. That sign wasn't. I don't put see a bad luck. That I know. I know for everybody. Yeah. I know bad luck because <laughs> I would call it stupidity. Car. No, did you see the sign? I see, remember me. I have the discussion. No, no, no. This I is for did the, right. see the sign. So what? And I was like, okay, that you one that I believe it. Come and I, I got focused on that. I'm focusing on what's here in front of me. Right. It never work. It wasn't different, like that. Different, so, different so, strokes are different. Yeah. Right. Hold on. Didn't you probably think you chose the wrong man from day one? You know what? Like I said, the kind of man that made it used to. That's what no, I'm no, no. Even without that. Because if, if we see some of the signs mm -hmm. and ignore them, you don't think that's your fault? It was my fault because I did see the sign. I ignored it open. So you can't blame the man alone. I blame myself really because I mm. seen the sign and I was only hoping things would get better but like you i said i'm blind. here with you turn a blind eye right it's well, not I'm even in your eyes all right so ah. i'm in your face all right, right so, now, so all right let's hear the story so you meet the man attracted to him what happened next when he start date him start court you what then the truth come out of papers in the ones no 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 before and we get no forget about that part so you're dating you're dating yeah, man, him, him, him wine and dine me okay. yo at so one work point way. Uh, Colleen, at one Talk point at way. one point i i was having knee issues i said the man i never know jamaican man turn doctor and he turned the doctor on my knees if so he, he treated me, you he treated good. me like a queen yo the man make sure bills peer if you are mad by me care mm, to be smart. honest he caught me i'm like i found the perfect catch yeah so what started to happen that makes this in getting papers how, <laughs> how all right how soon <laughs> no how soon after the courting and dating you know got married about a year one year and what did he propose to you on my birthday he did on yeah. his birthday so you on feel my birthday on your birthday so yeah. you know a real love yeah i right? thought so mm -hmm. you thought so <laughs> all right so when i'm married what start going wrong <sighs> when the baby mother got called upon the video i'm gonna show my face <laughs> 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 I can't tell you the truth. And I said, it's that we're on our way to church. So, you are living together, right? Yeah, we've been living together, right? yeah. And on a married. So, this is yeah. your man. Husband. Yeah, your man, mm -hmm. right? From paper and. Legit. This yes. is in so Canada. I thought. So I this did. is in Canada. This is in Canada. In Canada. Trust me. And I'm not the only one. Let me tell you something, people. <laughs> so let me learn. Eh? No. So hold on. So you, he was in Canada. You marry him in Canada. I married him in Canada. So he was illegal. He in was Canada. illegal. Yeah, for four years the farm in work, eh? eh? A farm worker. A farm worker, man. Tim can tell him. Mr. Oh, you know. <laughs> yeah, about that situation. <laughs> 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 oh, you don't tell. <laughs> no, I can't. My mom is a psychic <laughs> reading. Listen, the majority of the man in Canada are farm worker, And honestly, they make the good suffer for the bad. All right. So now, all good. How it start going bad? When we are at <laughs> church one Sunday, and the baby mother got called, video call, and then put the camera upon me. So I'm like, hi. I hate that. Girl, hang up phone. <laughs> I eat this stuff. I'm dead, so, it's so she didn't know you and him was married. She, yeah, but she, you see, him leader. Him tell her I said for papers. Yes, him tell her I said a business. So she fear remarks is they know what business and you sleep with her. <laughs> and when me hear the voice note, me say whoa. And my accent, him say I don't need that. I don't need she attack. So it was all it was all plan. All right. So what start happening now? Well. The truth reveal, and as a woman, you know, no. we start. So, you start to learn the different things now, and yeah. you see it. 
Yes, so during the process of him uh, getting papers by them, him getting work permit now, and okay. and so you know the the part the trust him lead to me and say all right when the paper then come the um, letters them come open it so I start opening one point now I needed some information so I'm saying going on my phone so I'm going on my phone and I did so I am you know the detective so. part come so out so he now. go you go on the phone and watch he found vice note from um, from, from who he, her from the baby him, mother yeah and then he might answer back all from him kids them and him friend them stating mm. that you're just for business for just for business and well, wanted mm -hmm. all right so how you approach him now to say this going down i i i said it to him i'm like so i just the papers you want all right i don't have a problem come i love my money talk to me we never married you for that no that married you for so i'm like okay so right now my head is clicking now i'm saying okay then oh my god come out of that one here the winner yeah, really say man a plan got a wife. And how much uh, years yeah. after you married this is? Two. Oh, two years. All right. Right after. Man, it wasn't even no long stretch of nothing in the marriage. You know, it was all pre-planned, everything planned. Everything planned. And when him get the, the, the PR card now. That's like a green card. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. But in America, it's green card. Right. It's PR. PR card. So on the December now, December the 4th to be exact, 2019. Hmm. Just before pandemic. Just the day before we anniversary. Oh no. Man look pan me and say, yo, me I forgot Jamie. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, drink liquor water. Please. <laughs> drink liquor water. Slow down me, come in. Uh, I drink liquor um, the um the slow one. <laughs> yeah, please. No my truth, man. I'll never forget the story. That's why I'm half a writer book. Mm -hmm. And my anniversary Eve, you look pan me and say, Yeah, I forgot Jamaica. Mm -hmm. And I'm thinking Okay, me and you go. Cause the next year we anniversary and four day after your birthday. Yeah. Well, I would drive come here. <laughs> so, I mean, no, 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 right no more. Right no more worried. We feel like we <laughs> feel like we're dropping No, I got played. I, I, I accept. Um, you know what I might have played. Oh, oh this is what is this then? You are used exactly for um. The betterment of of someone else and his family. <laughs> you know, I'm going to link Don't you say you agree with me? <laughs> yes. You agree with me, right? I got you. Right, but, I but remember, she came straight for you and said, okay, let's just, let's pay for this yeah. and we're good. And he convinced her, no, I, I didn't marry you for that. Hey, let me tell you something, Colleen. You see, sometimes men, I can't say for me personally. I have a lot of friends. Right, I make conversations right. and, 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 you know, you've been around and you're here. Men sometimes tend to like say, get a one slap off of that cat today. And, and then it turned into some 25 years of the marriage and of course, 10 years. Of and course. You know, there was no intention to be with of her. things going so. I mean, no situations in your case when we were in, people were involved got married basically for um permanent yeah. stay yeah. and it end it up work it work out good of course yeah because so no, sometimes it's not that's every when situation yeah that's yeah. when you tell her from all right so how was the sex the sex was amazing no oh, god Lord. It drink, was, drink, drink look at more water <laughs> <moment. laughs> no drink look like the slow wine carlin where can i get the slow wine to buy it? <laughs> Airport, <laughs> right here at the bridge on my page, make a nightclub. Okay, so people, this one that Carlin is promoted, I'm fully endorsing it. Yes, because it have mummy talking a lot of things here tonight. The real time, <laughs> I only talk the truth and nothing but the truth. The truth. So that was the confusion now because it's good and bad. Mm. You know, good <laughs> sex and then bad behavior. Yeah, him feel like him find a fool and it, Carlin, I try to warn him, don't play me. I'm the girl. You just keep it real with, and then you keep it moving. Don't do it to me, because if you do it to my head, I got trip, and that happened. The man I locked me up, you know? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Lock you up in jail? Yeah, the man locked me up. The man locked me up December the 4th, like I said. Why? <laughs> he locked me up. The baby man I tell him, say, when I'm going to Jamaica now, um, the night, as a woman, man tell me, I used to carry that woman, we have a tendency to think so when we dial police, the police them is on our side. Oh, this is domestic something. <laughs> 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 
Ten years. Yeah, ten years. Do me the problem, man. <laughs> what the problem? I problem? know everything works for everybody. <laughs> people that's younger way younger you all know why i'm like way <laughs> younger than that and, and act so mature you of wouldn't course even know. it's true. just his intention you know? was wrong it, it, yeah just that's wrong just, intention that has nothing to do with the age yeah but all they have to do is tell me the truth me just want my peer pad and keep in mind that five of them make it landed you know a man in four picking them the boy i'll bring up baby mother <laughs> Whoa. Why were you locked up? Let me drink some other water. <laughs> Why were you locked up? <laughs> the man locked me up. The man, when he came to Jamaica, the girl, I guess the girl must have tell him, say, uh, when the police them call him out here, um, she must charge her. When you go up, charge her. Charge her. And he come up, you know? And the moment the police them locked me up December 14th, Why? charged me for uttering deadly threat to him oh. and him. Oh, you put your hand on him? No. I'm not a physical oh, oh, abusive. Oh, oh, threat. Oh, yeah, them thing. They say I got to shoot him and this and no, that. And the man, I'll tell him to my back gun pan him. It was <laughs> lies. <laughs> it's lies. That where may I get gun from? Me wouldn't know, mommy. <laughs> me wouldn't know, mommy. Me wouldn't know. Me is probably by your history. This <laughs> is in baby mother and him cook up the stories yes. to get her in yeah, to problems. get me into problem but god is so gosh i'm telling her believe in our god here yeah because it just flipped the script flip and him get charged for assault and then end up charging me for public mischief come and cut up the clothes i mean I admit to it <laughs> oh you <laughs> cut up his clothes yes then let me buy them candy you know, yeah, carry to Jamaica, mm-hmm. so i did cut them up <laughs> Uh, Carly, let, let me just let me, let me just point out something here. A friend of <laughs> mine sweet. just texts me and say, "Um, why me call young girls yame? Let me clarify this for you, please, sweetheart. It's not all young, young girls, girls right. are yame, but exactly. this new thing where them I call right. them. what you did say, Carly, in, um, chicken head, chicken head, chicken head, our age, yeah. yeah. So the new thing now where them call the girls, them when they have no sense. Chicken heads, yame, yeah, yame, yeah. yeah. <laughs> So, let me just clarify that. So, sweetheart, don't feel like every young girl is a, is a young man. No, my daughter is Some of them are pumpkin head. On her body. Some of them are rice and peas head. And <laughs> some of them are, yeah. So, you have good girls and bad girls. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. CJ, hope so, you're learning. So, I'm so, learning so, a lot, to be so, honest. So, <laughs> we're going to go to our break. But when we come back, I'll ask Christine a question. We'll be right back. Yes, welcome back to Sex on the Bridge, and that's Shabba with Crystal, twice my age. Trust me, man, song of the decade. Poor young boy, them couldn't get no one. Because <laughs> all, 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 all of the young girls was just going for the twice my age. Yep. <laughs> no, for whatever the reason. Um, as you were saying, when we went to the break, well, we did left half. The part went locked me up. <laughs> no, yeah, we got to that. that <laughs> enough for public mystery. Um, but is it a thing that younger men are always attracted to you? They come at me. I don't know if they feel like to say because um, of who I am and them can't, why we can't get certain things from Christine, you know. Christine can bring me a, my family a foreign. Christine can make me, me, me find a link for bring up some things. Why you think it's only that? Christine, well, what nice. Else could it be? Oh, you mean you're beautiful? Your hair real. Yo. With little color it. on it. I'm yet to find a man who look at me and say, Look, it's it. only in the Call last it. couple of years she put on so much Call weight. It. She's nice. Mm-hmm. You can mute the mic for a minute. Come on, and tell mute, us. Yeah. Mute the mic. No, don't mute the mic. <laughs> you said me never involved. Christine would be your <coughs> girl. <coughs> so yeah, I she, don't know what you she, think. My, my watch her when I come to the studio. She have all the physical attributes. Exactly. I'm see she had look for me too, but mommy, I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> yeah, but <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> take it. Yeah. You, know, <laughs> you see, him, girlfriend, if you're listening, trust me, I have a good man here. I'm real. Yeah. And that's the he's key. Mommy, and he's mommy, mommy, like that. Christine mm-hmm. is a nice person. Yeah, I don't. Engineer, I'm going to get the number for you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to take that concept out of your head because of that cross is mine. Yeah. Because me. you know, you know when women are hurt, they tend to go down the line thinking every man might Yeah, no, every man a dog, you know, no, no, every woman no, a, I, 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 I have t- I got baptized, you know. I mm-hmm. I got baptized January 29, 2022. Good. And let me tell you something. The CMD I got baptized, the CMD of the man carried the woman and him two two two, two time four kids at Canada. And I found out that day. But I tell him again, 
if you don't know God, you don't find him. Because I tried to commit suicide. Mm. You never know that boy, your auntie, no. you see, Jay? I tried, because I live in a building and I have a solarium. We try to lick out the glass for jump because it wasn't for him. It was for the, the shame that, yeah, that, the that, yeah, the embarrassment that I thought I brought on my, I don't have a mother no more. My dad, my, my father didn't like the man, you know, and my kids them fell for this man. So it was like I brought shame down on them again. And Carlin, you know, I, I was in prison. My life was bad. And then I find a good man, I thought that, you know, to go straight now. And it get worse. Things happen. It happened to the best of us. So. It, it's just a learning process. Oh, gosh. So when you attack, you know, that's what I'm saying. I yet to find a man who said, yo, I'm like a lady of fish. There are men there. Yeah. There are. You had a great baby father, fish eye. Fish eye. Rest so, in peace, my you darling. You know, mm -hmm. don't think you passed the, mm -hmm. the, the journey of never to find yeah. real love. Never too late. Yeah. Never too late. You know, I don't think love real. I don't think love there. L love is a feeling that you felt like you never felt before. Well, I would like to feel it again. Well, mm -hmm. I'm did, did, looking did at you and I'm telling you, listeners, you uh, and, and viewers. She's on nice. The, on she smells good. Our she, skin pretty, nice. pretty, pretty, pretty. Yes. You're going to find the right person. And she's a to so, die um, for person. Yeah. Let's not even leave that You part can out. get Christian information by calling Bridge FM. The <laughs> WhatsApp line is 8776-551-5782. And you can get Christian's information. And uh, men, if you're calling to get papers, if you're calling to get papers, take that out your mind. Yes, she's not giving nobody else no more papers. Did your family and friend... Um, thought that he was too young for you? Did anybody no. think that? Him look older than me. I know. Him look tall. Look yeah, coming by most farm worker. <laughs> so it's kind of did rough on him. Jesus Christ. But before the man could have worked, you know, the man, eh, the man, yo, he can turn this studio into a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful And pizza. that, no, trying to honor them nice of me, I said, no, so I mean, I met this man ago. Did tell the man? You know, said, I'm used and to the sex was good. The sex was good. Drink water, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then drink the clarity slow and after, please. <laughs> and go on my lawn. <laughs> I said, go remember you in a church, no, you ain't Oh, that's another thing. Tell yes, no, you Carly. Where Before said, you no. start, Tom, I'm one of the people that understand one thing. I am a woman of God now. Me and I'm a Christian. Don't call me a Christian. I'm mm -hmm. a radical woman of God. Mm -hmm. And because we're in at the church, I mean to say we're not real. We keep exactly. Real, you same, still have life. Okay. Come on. First, clear that up. And if they want to use that word because that's all they understand, go ahead. She, yeah. you, well, you know what they mean by it, and that you are a child uh, of God. I'm a wow. woman of God, yeah. yeah. You're, yes, I'm the Me, you are going, you know. So, your girlfriend is 10 years younger, yeah, presently, yeah, yeah. Good. How did that happen? Oh, mm -hmm. you decide that you're going to finally settle down and with a younger girl. You know, so I really um, keep an event and my girl and my sister come with a couple of friends and them things. I'm being a jovial person I am. I bought a regular and I try to break it. When my sister come in, I say, what a nice shaping girl and everything. And I just try to put the bubble gum in my mouth and put the next. And I try to come here. Take the bubble gum out of my mouth. I like, she said to her, she the said, first time you seen her? The first time you seen her, I like, she said, oh, what kind of man this? <laughs> I'm so dear in her, like, yeah. dirty man, because I'm dirty man <laughs> this. <laughs> and she looked me down, because I'm nice, you know, girl, I'm nice, <laughs> yeah, I'm yeah, so me into myself. Yeah. And then she looked and she said, no, I'm fingernail, I'm well groomed, and I'm taking and himself. Like and, and, and I'm well clean. Yeah, and I'm, I'm yeah. well shine too. I said, I said, no. I should put the bubble gum in her mouth and the rest was history. So you, she took the bubble gum from you? Yeah. From your mouth? Mm -hmm. hmm. Good girl. Um, yeah, How I mean, much years ago this is or months? I look a while now. I look a while. Okay. Any kids? No. She have two kids. We may consider my kids. Okay. Good yeah. Man. So. Any plans on marrying her? That is always a good thing, you know. Right. Yeah. But she invite me. We don't. She not married me for the papers. <laughs> <laughs> yes. 
And me not mad if you're not paper. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> she have a pride straight. Good girl. You know, sometimes me might do a little wrong thing in terms of, you know, but good girl. We, we, are, we, are fix, we are fix things in the way it should come. You know what? Me done with the road. Me done with the road. Good so, any woman out there listening and saying them want to get to me, <laughs> I'm taking. <laughs> Done with that. Mm. Is would you do it any differently if you had a choice? Would you want her younger or older, or you just like her who she is? No, I'm comfortable where I'm at now. Have you ever dated an older woman than yourself? Yes, I did at one point. Um, all this came about, you know, Kali. You know, say <laughs> sometimes you meet people that's a very strange situation. I was at the toll booth because I live in, I reside in Portmore. And I saw this person like pulled over with their flashes on and I was like I looked in and I saw it was a female and I was like, sweetheart, um, what's wrong with you? Because I'm You like that. Yeah, I just my nature that to try and help people in some way. And she said <laughs> she started laughing like she said it's too embarrassing to say what it was. And I said, um she said, no, mom, all right, I can't talk. It's all right, it's all right. I said, no, mommy, what is wrong with you? Your battery. She said, no, everything good with the car. And I'm telling her, what happened? And she said, um, to be honest, I left my purse at work not realizing I'm going to have the money to pay the toll. And she called somebody. We have to go come all the way now to come, come meet her. Give her the money to pay the toll for her and themselves. And then go back and I say, mommy, drive behind me. And she come in the lane behind me. I pay my toll and pay yeah, hers yeah. at the same time. Yeah. And when she come through the toll now, she pull up beside me and say, um, Give me a number. I'm going to s- uh, let you get back the money. I said, no, mommy, a simple thing. Not and she said, no, I really appreciate it. Like she said, she can't believe it's a good man still. Eh. I'm right. a, a conversation with her like, through WhatsApp at the time. And she said, you know, I really appreciate it. And she explained to me where, you know, she had got through all kind of thing. And then she, in- she invited me out. She literally looked me. How oh, older was she than you? Um... She was about 15 years old. <laughs> 15? Yeah. yeah. Okay. But it, she was a nice woman. But here's the thing, you know. Me can't yeah, take why it sp- didn't work? Me can't take the spoon feeding thing. Mm. She wanted to pamper you? Yeah, me, me, me like pampering, but it's too much. <laughs> <laughs> she want to give me money for go cut me here. <laughs> she want to um, meet me nail tech. She, wa- she me can't bother like that. She want to wear some she, some. She big got too controlling. Yeah, too much, too controlling. I'm going to say, mommy. This is where it stops. <laughs> New engine. Oh, I got to go. <laughs> All right, we have some voice now. <laughs> <laughs> Which is sometimes the both ways, both men yeah. and women. It gets too controlling. Good night, everyone. So I've dated a seven to eight years old man. I'm currently in my late twenties, so yeah, that's pretty old. <laughs> um, but not a pretty top. It mean, it mean bad. It did mean and all he could offer me was lunch and i can't buy that myself because i work so when i told him that listen i'm gonna need more you know he's like okay we'd have to be intimate first and i was just like no what happened to like proper dating you know he's fully divorced trying to put him foot back out there in this whole dating relationship thing i was like that's how you expect to like impress a woman but i don't know them not too different from the young one them to be honest them to me them all worse them worse and the thing is i realize that they love to control and they love when women are vulnerable you know when they are damsel in distress so it wasn't cutting it for for us at all because one i work and I take my work seriously. So when he would want me to get off work early or something, I don't go to work just to hang around him. I'm like, no, I need to work. And I'm not going to take off today. I'll see you another time. It wasn't working for him because he wants to control everything. All right. You see, when we tell you about the age, it doesn't matter if she was too young. Man, a man. People are people. Age, as it said, don't. It's just a number. 
you'll mm. get now 78 years old. Where am I be mean about? How much more time in my life? If you just give away my time soon, dead. Time soon, dead. I'm glad to some young girl finding my job. That's to see. <laughs> yes, mm-hmm. go. We have another one. Um, she was acting like my mom, mm. definitely, and she didn't want to control my life. Um, she, d- why do we have a camping rock? Cause she definitely knew what she wanted in the bed, and me can't keep up with that. Um, yeah, that's the craziest thing. Yeah. So much here, and them know what them want. That me like them. We wait on somebody who is trying, young girl, them just want a quick thing right now. Yeah. That's uh, what I like about dating older girls is the fact that they are mature in my eyes at a certain level, the way that they can relate to me in terms of conversation, in terms of their philosophy, in terms of reasoning. And I just like that about them, that we can we're cohesive yeah, we can get each other on a personal level. So how much older are you talking? About three years older. Mm, would you go older than three years? No, sir, that that would have been too much still. Why? Yeah. To be honest, mom, no, she did before me. As it goes both ways, older man, older woman, it's gonna be in control. One, especially if it's not like not well, I don't know him. Find somebody only three years older than him, I walk control him. <laughs> she definitely have man issues, mm-hmm. but usually, you know, the 10, the 15, the 20, and upwards, mm. you feel like this person is your child. Yeah. Um, that's for one of the reasons why I'm not attracted to younger men like that, you know, especially you no, know, I'm 50. Where am I going with a 25 year old man? What am I trying to do? You know, I see you some women with it. It's not cute, All right? It's mm-hmm. You know, it's not cute. I don't, I don't like it for the men either. It's not cute, mm-hmm. and I have a problem with men dating women younger than their children. Sure, mm-hmm. it just creepy to me. Yeah, that yeah. looks old. Yeah, I, I find it. And women who date men younger than their children, mm-hmm. especially their That's sons, right. mm-hmm. you know, it just seems. But people do what. People do what suits them and whatever makes them happy. We have another voice now. We have another voice now. <laughs> Eighteen girls who are younger than me. The fact that they are not, mm, I would say, mature enough in in a uh, in a certain level. Like what's that level? What level are you talking about? In terms of reasoning how they operate, you know, how they operate socially or over social media Mm -hmm. or in person, you know, the mature enough, you know, them not, them not really. What's the... They just want a quick thing, most of them want this lifestyle where it's only attainable if they did already have money. Mm. If they need already born with certain things and most of them them feel like they are mature so they go to all the men so why are we not go to all the women too? Okay. The 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 more is that the young girls are are uh, fantasizing. Most of them they will get them. <laughs> I don't know. They just they just they start to them fear and and them feel like say them know what life is about. Cause most of them they love the way how them think love go as some fear it is. Exactly. They believe say oh yeah, as one argument go on if you just cuss and then you know on a make up whatever. Yeah. They know you pray and then guess what the man I will just come and kiss you on your leg and hear you and that's how things were brother you see. And okay. they believe say as I was saying it's more a financially directed thing. Mm. Them, them just want to live comfortable. We can't really be able to want them to live comfortable. Yes. But me at what, 20, now I'm going to drive a Benz. Can I bring him? Yeah. Uh, 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 well, well, 420, yeah. go, go eat a meal. A very expensive meal, like probably uh, $50,000. And a car center work. I mean, I did her from like high school. Oh. From level grade six form, I mean, six form. Until today, this day. So.
So really and truly, me never date nobody really older. No, mostly like in the high school coming up was like 16. But I just see me never really depending on nobody else. And even though she's younger than you, you still yeah. find that you guys are compatible. Yes. You think she's mature in in Yeah, know? yeah, because as life goes on every day, yeah, I grew. Mm -hmm. So just we understand each other and respect each other. So just like that we just grew together. <laughs> Alright, you see with with the call one of the callers, right? Um who says the fact is, he works at a call center with female look up here, and she, the young girl, is going to want to see what her friends do, go on these expensive, elaborate dates. How is he going to afford it? Sitting, yes, them, see them friend gone to uh, Dubai. No, start pressure this poor little boy. And as him say, he's 20. Where would he be getting a Benz from unless he is a scammer? Or a drug dealer at that age, you know, mm -hmm. or he's driving his parents' car. Mm -hmm. So it, he has limitations to it. So it's now going to force her and him to break up because yeah, no. him can't afford what the lifestyle she wants to yeah. have. And so she might end up with an older man, as, yep. as Talman said earlier, for the finance. No, for go live this. But if you heard the, the girl before, she went with this 78 <laughs> year old man who was giving her nothing but lunch. <laughs> <laughs> she mean him. She <laughs> him. Yeah, him mean. So you might go, go to the. You'd stay with your young boyfriend and build it, and the Tony might can't go to Dubai. Exactly. So, wow. Yeah. So somebody who was dating the, the last caller, they were dating from high school and they built together and, and grew together. Yep. That's what he had said yep. earlier. That's what you had said. That's what I prefer. Day. Us being just building together and making our way up. Because if you want somebody that's, if you're expecting me to buy you these big bends and carry up to Dubai yeah, and all that stuff. and all this at your little salary where you're a billion yourself. Exactly. You need to find a man that's already up there. So an older person. But you can't expect somebody that's the same age as you. Well, I guess because you're a dancer plus actor, mm -hmm. you know, they know the money going to come, but they want to spend it before you get it. Exactly. <laughs> that can't work out. Can't work. So how are you and this older woman working up? We don't have a title because, to be honest, I don't do titles just because of my career. Because all the time when I'm, when when I go through this stuff, it's always my fault that the relationship ends because of what I do. I'm always busy. I'm always traveling for work, so it doesn't work out. But at this point, we're not a title, but I like where it's going just because she understands what I'm doing. Okay, and she's giving you the 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 freedom to breathe exactly and because i've been without the pressure i've been with females like younger younger females that get mad when i'm not with them 24 7 and i can't be with somebody 24 7 not at this point exactly and nobody really wants anybody 24 7 exactly unless it's an obsession behavior you know you want to mm. go out and coming back and see each other exactly. and if you take oh, I miss you. yeah exactly and i find it's more it's more <laughs> better when i haven't seen them in so long and it's like okay i haven't seen you in so long you know everything's good now it's all I like you always all starting over exactly but when you're with each other 24 7 i almost feel like you get sick of each other yeah especially not, at my well, age no you won't get sick of each other if you really love each other right because right, right. you'll find ways to intertwine that but if your jobs until you going away you would have to respect that. Then exactly. I'm not the girl for you. I'm not the guy for you. Mm -hmm. You know, then don't don't date me and expecting me. What she want you to quit and go get a call center or a 95 mm -hmm. or Burger King or one of them. That's not going to bring the money she also wants. Yep. And he works hard. Mm -hmm. I have two more voice notes. Bridge Nation, manners, ah, this older person, younger person thing. As a female, it's so cliche, but definitely older people are attractive or men are attractive because of what they can provide for you financially, but can they provide it sexually? That's a whole different question. So for me, it's all about what you're looking for in a relationship. It's all about what you're looking for from the relationship. And if somebody care about that, then we're good, you know? But you know uh, it, it doesn't matter the age you know love is love so hi guys so um so another thing would be like um i'm a business oriented person so i like somebody who can pass off knowledge who can encourage me 
um, who will mov motivate me and I'm just aiding that process on a whole so I am not where you met me like I need to be climbing to another level you know at a good momentum at a good pace to establish and just to be a better person so that is another reason for dating an older man all right so as again that let's not knock younger girls younger boys because they are responsible younger men mm -hmm. and they are responsible younger women True. who knows what they want we have a lot of business savvy young men who knows what they want dating their school friend the girlfriend from school mm -hmm. and they're building so it's not a hundred percent nowhere across the board you do have older men who are gonna just keep you in a corner there is no growth he wants you to only depend on him and so if it's for this he stifles all your dreams mm -hmm and make sure you only can depend on him yeah. that's one of the things you young girls have to be careful about these there are older men like that who are sharks and they know what they have in terms of for her parents and say okay she can't leave because she can't leave because she can't do without him you know this to tell men where men do that control without doing the control mm -hmm. so yeah. she doesn't even understand that he's buying her all the things that she needs, but not building her to all the things she will want. Yeah. And so if she decide, as the one of the girls says, the sex sometimes with the older man is boring because they can only do but so much. Some of them, and there's everything is summer, you know, the, the, the penis erection is not as much. The whole shebang is just not as much. Why am I one to come like a vibrator? <laughs> he was good. I think that's what caught me too. He was <laughs> damn good. When I turned the man coming like he, he was, yo, he caught me. That's probably one of the reasons. You know, I feel like I that you miss more than anything else for me. So too, you know. <laughs> it's not miss nothing. I miss, but you know, it got boring after a while too. Have you done do it too often? Well, it, no. You felt the difference. It yeah. was just sex. It was. It wound down to just sex. I think so. So that that romantic attraction that you want from the relationship was going because when you find out the truth it hurts yes and it's hard for you to then pretend yeah and i couldn't pretend no more All right so the sex is going to be sex mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. sex without emotion is boring yeah mm -hmm. for a man Literally. it's okay because you know you know both yeah. of you that sex for you is to have an orgasm for women it's not like that. the average man well we, we're talking yeah. about just basic you know mm -hmm. when you're not into the girl anymore like that so it's just to have an orgasm mm. so it can't go to nothing else mm. you know that that latin connection and she started to feel it so that's when you once you knew the sex started to get boring to you mm. you know uh, when it come from jamaica after i'm charged man we 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 started to go out again you know we started right, to try to work make it up out. and whatever but it wasn't the same, wasn't the same. no because you already it was, lost trust yeah it was like uh, Ew, you went there and you're coming back here and it's a man who like use condom so you start getting scared all right Trust and that condom me. break we're gonna <laughs> break from the <laughs> condom we'll be right back seen <laughs> seen by decca jams yes welcome back to sex on the bridge and i'm speaking with christine jackson hey guys. tall man and tj and we're talking about does age really matter I hope you've been listening to their stories, the calls, the 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 the, the four guests in here, um, stories, um, and the voice notes coming in because Whoa. this is a yeah, this is a some of these voice notes are interesting. Yeah, this is a show of Very that we have another voice note. Oh, all right, and the numbers to call is eight seven six six seven six. For 996 if you want to talk straight or you can send voice note 876-551-5782 and the voice we did this we got the voice notes you know for the credit and people credit known so if you notice that send a voice note whatsapp style mm -hmm. and we hear I like this show it cater for the <laughs> different class of people of because some people just don't have the credit what them have internet, internet right yes. Yes. and especially at 10 o'clock at night you're home yeah and right. you know relaxing hopefully you know gearing up mm. ready what's what's the worst thing you'd say about dating younger girls 
they tend sometimes to be a little bit too much too uh, materialistic where it's all about hair nails and um shoes that's the that's 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 materialistic in in the wanting to buy a bag every for week for the n- yeah for, party. for every event o- event they want a different outfit they don't know if it mix and match and and them but things we were like that growing up yeah but no you know. we found it for ourselves we did it yeah we, yeah, we would yeah. care for um, man yeah never depend I think, we I think, I think, the man. i think that's the, you know. the, the the worst thing that can happen when you date a, a younger woman when you they, they sometimes can be a little bit too materialistic and if you don't don't nip it in 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 in, in the point at, at a certain said point more it, to it, life. It, it will get, get yeah, it, so it, it, this is where it comes in as a older man you have to make them know say listen moment you earn twenty thousand a week join a little partner for three thousand take out your lunch money and your bus fare and this and that remember me i pay the rent me i pay most of the bills and them thing me. you take care of the food blah yep. blah blah we have to we have to sit down and 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 and, and guide educate them, and guide it yeah so yeah, you know you have to yeah it can't be yeah. every party you have a new mm-hmm. hairstyle mm-hmm. new shoes new it's bag, not worth new everything. it really yeah. isn't and you're not going there to be paid mm-hmm. yeah. and then what you do with this outfit i hear next week it's you a know, new it's a one new weirdo and that's it. Yeah, because I'm having this thing I know you can't repeat if them <laughs> see and then social media you know mm, yeah. These and, and what are the next thing to you know Carleen and and, and, and and listeners, you know? Younger women send, sometimes tend to live a social media. Right, because that's the era that we're in. We are in that and era. it's fake. Half of it is fake. It is. Yeah, it's so. fake. So you you see Jazz as a social media influencer. You find say younger girls come at you more a lot recently like a lot since i've grown on social media multiple dms girls that wouldn't even talk to me back then now talking to me and i'm just like what was the change and the only change was that i grew on social media they see me go in la new york here there and they're just like wow Mm -hmm. now i want to talk to me and all that stuff and i'm just saying hmm imagine i was trying to get with you guys before and now you guys want to talk to me now Yes. So it's just like, <laughs> but then it feels good. I'm like, I just, I just, just don't even go for them. Right, because you like know you the motive. Exactly. I know exactly what you guys are looking which for. Which is, which is what it is. Even with, with, with Talman, when they're managing the artists, they don't have to look girls. The girls look the girls them because mm-hmm. they're artists. You know, mm-hmm. they, they assume they have the profile, the money, mm-hmm. you know, what they need. And sometimes yeah. them would Somet- like, no. Sometimes a female, they don't know Talman, you know. They don't know Davis Scott. Right, them only know tall bars. Them know tall bars. So, <laughs> yeah, me no, me no need if a tall bar. But no. well, the program is good. Because you know what? You, CJ, just got a nice link right here with your artist. Listen, what's for you, what's the biggest lesson you learned from what you did? Don't do it again. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's simple. You see, if you don't have your papers, don't come to me. <laughs> I'm dead serious. No. <laughs> Did I hear that? But what happened if him, him think you think you remember you have connections, you have links? What happened if him have him paper and think you can help him become Why am I to come good? Okay. I'm building time. Ladies, if you find a man and him not have nothing, don't show him away now. Seek him out, find out things first. Bill with him. Wow, wow, I'm wow, like wow, a man wow. with me and him bill from nothing to something. Wow, I don't wow. want a man that rotten, rotten rich kind of me alone. I got of. Why wow, you think him can't wow. have you alone because he's rich? Yeah. Huh? Nine out of ten, the man them will have them things down pat are What's all players. Mm. And your biggest <coughs> regret? What's your biggest regret? In in um the relationship. <sighs> Follow the red flags. Your first intuition, follow it. Yep, I didn't. I threw it aside. And if I did follow it, I don't think <laughs> I would have been caught up so much. Mm-hmm. You know? Because we now lead ourselves wrong, you know? The first impression you get in a relationship, follow it. Well, he's still in the relationship. What so far, what's the strongest lesson you've learned so far? dating an older woman 
that they they know what they want i would say and i feel like they're not as much users compared to the younger ones right whoa <laughs> and tell me what's your fear Can in you dating a know? younger girl if you have any um which you should have <laughs> Yeah, you put me on the spot. But um, in all honesty, I'm very particular in who I choose to have a relationship with. But look, I, I try to be a friend before I become your partner. Amen. So what I do is that I, I seek, I hunt, I seek and find mm -hmm. the, the good qualities and the bad qualities. If the bad qualities are something that can be a job, I'm not going to train you. Cause I, I, people, a dog, get train. And you're not the body's it yeah so what i do if it's something where we can discuss and and compromise and say and work out. yeah we, we try and fix things as best as possible to suit both parties yeah. it, it's not going to be all about me or it's not going to be all about you i believe in us okay. and what would what would be the the message you give to a younger girl going into an older man's relationship if if um, you have it don't be too dependent try to be more independent True. Okay. It, it, it's plain and simple as that take your money and work in business mm -hmm. i'm not take not i wouldn't say take his money because you know, that's sound like like you like you look a gold you like you're a gold digger <laughs> um put yourself in a give your money make you yeah, yeah you put yourself so in a yeah. position yeah. where if anything should go around right. you can stand that on your own yes. two feet because yeah. if the man leaves you then you don't have nothing Right. Mm -hmm. Producer, you hear that? Okay. <laughs> what? I'm saying to the producer, did she hear what um, we just said? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so, Carolyn, yeah, ask us all these questions. Let's ask you. What about yeah. you? What's your take on this yeah. whole situation? Remember, I'm the hostess. I invite yeah. you guys. But I will answer. Remember, I said from in the beginning, I don't mm -hmm. like younger, younger men yeah. i don't i'm not attracted to them that don't mean i've not dated younger man Whoa. right yes mm. but i don't like that's not my first choice Choice, right? but as you said earlier age is you said earlier age is just a number i am attracted to a person and not their age but if it's if if i can look and tell that like you could not be in my book no day because mm -hmm. i can look at you and say okay that's a young yeah. kid yeah now if you look like a grown-up and then molly here say yeah x and i can live with that because then we might still match mm -hmm. you know because you look mature mm -hmm. enough still not going to nobody no 20 nothing m not even 30 you better be in 40s and going up you know i can probably take somebody 40 and up based on it would be the 10 10 years line yeah. you know but i would have prefer if he's 10 years older than i am True. it's just my choice of i and know nothing I is am. wrong with that yeah mm -hmm. i am preference. a bully sure. i am a bully so Sally, don't so say that oh, yes no, I, am. I don't think you are i am in my relationship no not on a general well, okay okay yeah, yeah, in my yeah. relationship so no, if I you are not bully. I don't. I don't like, like the choice of that word, Carly. No, I think you should. I'm a bully. You like I lead. think you say. Um, I oh would no, say I'm you're more even, dominant. Mm, mm -hmm. I'm not even clearing it up when going. Up, I'm a bully. Okay, you're not pretty. No, though. I'm not putting it up. <laughs> so if I can get that opportunity or get that on you, I'm gonna take it, right? I am a yeah. I'm a very strong personality, strong person, mm -hmm. and that even if you're hundred, I still gonna try to bully you. Because she's independent. Yeah. Oh, wow. So it's not about the age, you know. It's just who I am. And so if I don't have to go that way, then we're good. But Colleen, I'm saying this to say that if you know that you are a bully, you don't think you should at this point in your life make some adjustments? No, because there's, there's men out there that you can have that kind of relationship with. Okay. Yeah. Remember not that he's a weak man it's just that i'm a strong woman okay and i know my place though yeah so it's not okay. like i'm a bully in public you know this is behind closed door yeah. okay all right me understand yeah. you um, oh yeah no man you're missing it no it's no like no i'm not missing right. it i'm just want. i just wanted to clear oh, it up no, for the not, listening it's not a person the listening of, audience outside. and those and, yeah. and, 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 no, and no 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 it's not way. a it's not that kind of personality where okay i want to rule i don't want to rule you know rule and bully because you see carlin yeah. remember you are the queen exactly 
exactly. So, so sometimes you, the, the crown get big for your head. You, know, you have to remember. Well, and sometimes and you drop off too. <laughs> right, and, but you for also remember. Remember, I started this at a young age. So how do I know you're not only talking to me because, because of who I am? Yep. So why should I let down who I am? Yeah, you know because remember it happens. People go off for what they want mm -hmm. and what they see. Young man, we say, "Oh, yeah. I'm dreaming about you from um, yeah, mm -hmm. and then you get to be with me. You think, uh -huh. you think I don't have to live with that? Remember, just probably me. if I was just ex, you might not." date me don't care if i'm beautiful yes no or because so you always going to put that i was a pu i am a public figure and that might be your only motive mm -hmm. but that doesn't bother exactly. me exactly mm -hmm. because i'm such a bully that <laughs> doesn't bother me uh, that's not gonna do you nothing no it doesn't because i don't care if gentlemen if listening <laughs> out there that <laughs> likes calling she <laughs> said she can be a bully behind closed doors behind closed doors it's not a personality okay. that has nothing to do yes. with you know i don't want to belittle no man that i'm dating if you know you stand your ground you're the man and okay. i'm not taking that it's totally different from just saying it's my way or no way behind closed door mm -hmm. you understand it's 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 totally different from a woman you know emasculating a man and thinking she's a man no i'm no man I don't want to be a man. I don't want to rule you. Yes, just behind closed doors. Yep. No balls. Yeah. You're just no, I want, Yeah. I don't. I, I don't. <laughs> I don't want a man too who's gonna go toe to toe with me. Me being a woman, you know, mm. that don't make you no man. That yeah, don't get that twisted. Yeah. 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 You're like, punk. oh yeah, as me said too, you de ta. <laughs> no, <laughs> that, that, that doesn't bad. mean you're a man. No, we please don't show. miss that up. But we're actually at close to the end of the show, so I want you all to give how we can people can get to you on your social media mm -hmm. pages what's next for you so we start with mm -hmm. a baby in the group so you guys can follow <laughs> me on my handles cjjxckson i'm on instagram snapchat and tiktok and i'm uh, i'm an influencer actor and dancer so check out my stuff and what do you have anything coming up soon for anybody like you know could go see you or anything yes yeah, so i actually just did a commercial with Aleve medication that should be out by next month and that'll be playing all over the states on tv i did a film called see no evil that's coming out this year hopefully I'm just waiting for all the information to come out and i'm going on another tour i just got i heard all the information and i got my contract but i can't give you guys the information oh, of the yeah. locations yet, but i will be going on tour and be performing in around in a country i can't tell you the country well, yet though TikTok when this air is gonna go yeah. up more because they're gonna see the mm -hmm. dollars <laughs> so you guys follow me follow me on my socials and you guys will see it right. mm -hmm. right. <laughs> okay um you can find me on social media at tall boss underscore d underscore legend right what you have coming up what are some of the plans um, who well are some of the artists that you have well my main artist is bugle uh and i have two 90s artists i'm working with now ricky general and mega banton and lady g of course mm, yes. yeah those are the four main artists that i work with right now um primarily we just came from saint kids with bugle okay. and I, I just opened up a studio in portmore oh nice yeah so and um we have a restaurant bar and grill the legendary bar and grill so where is that that's um port and this road okay known as back road oh, oh. nice yeah <laughs> what's the name of it so people can the legendary bar and grill oh the legendary yeah and what's the food type like what kind of well food? we specialize in seafood okay yeah we specialize okay. in seafood yeah <laughs> all right and christine well anything else talman sorry um i just want to thank you for the opportunity mm -hmm. and you know carlene is, is is a nice individual as i said before and she's always trying and i'm encouraging those listening and watching to support her drive with her sister mm -hmm. i'm going to make my contribution very soon it's going to be very tangible carlene i'm saying this on air publicly because i I have been in a situation like what you're going through, but I must commend you on being the strong woman you are, and I'm encouraging the listeners to help out with this situation. Definitely. Thank you. Definitely. Christine? Well, um, tune in every Wednesday night. What is it? 9 o'clock Canadian time. That is 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock Jamaican time. I have a uh, on Instagram at Christine Jackson, Lady Promoter. 
it's keeping it real. We talk about real life things, very informative things that can be useful to a lot of people. You know, tune in. And um, again, like Talman just said, let's support Pinky. We are all human beings. We've all been through struggles and tomorrow, I promise, you never know. So while we're alive, let's help save a life. Yes, right. and so let's reach out. So you out. heard her, Christine Jackson, lady promoter on Instagram for her show every Wednesday night at 8 o'clock Jamaica time, 10, 9, nine o'clock Canadian time yep. for a talk um, Instagram, you know, podcast show, yeah. Keeping It Real. And as she, the title says, Keeping It Real. And you see how candid she speaks <laughs> and how real she speaks. <laughs> so, you know, you can imagine that it's great. And she also does a lot of charity work helping people right now you have a cancer patient also yeah i have a young lady named shanika she's only 21 years old and um she's going through some serious tribulation tune in for my program you'll hear more about her you know all right a new year well guys i want to thank you all so very much for an awesome Welcome. night tonight uh, yes does age matter you can figure it out if it does or doesn't from what we went through i want to thank you all all my listeners all my viewers and of course my panel i also have a show coming up on saturday the 29th of april yes in plantation cove down in saint anne shakadima suppliers murder she wrote celebrating 30 years in the music business mm -hmm. that one song been driving long before 30 years you know but it's been a hit for 30 years and so we're gonna pay homage and tribute to the murder she wrote so i will be performing with shakademos and pliers wow, on the 29th yes on the 29th of <laughs> april 2023 <laughs> saturday coming so you need to get your tickets all the fantanas mm -hmm. at the venue there is buses to take you from kingston otrius saint anne's um, Montego Bay to and from the Knoxwood Express. They're arranging for that so people can come down and go back home if they want. You know, you don't feel like drive because you want to enjoy the show. Tanya Stevens is, is on it. Richie Spice is on it. Um, Leroy Sibbles is on it. Shaq Dima Supplies is on it. That's all. Queen Carlene is on it. And Tommy Cohen will be hosting it. I, nice. If I forgot anybody, you know, just come. But that lineup alone tells you, you know, you need to see it. Celebrating the 30th year of Original. Murder, She Wrote. Yes. And of course, my sister Pinky, as I pledge to you guys every day, asking you to help me with her support in our treatment for cancer. Pinky is a pioneer in the dance hall. Yeah world you know she's one of the founders setting the trend for dance or women yep. and she's my reason for who i've become as i am representing dance all still she's my introduction to that so i just want to thank her i love you pinky you know this forever and ever yes and we're going to ride there's no dying we're going to fight cancer together mm -hmm. with all the persons who has been supporting her mm -hmm. the love that i've been receiving on instagram and on TikTok and all over the priors people sending yeah. you know some people are donating their little five dollars it's not little believe me every mickle make a muckle yep. and it starts somewhere so far we're four thousand something dollars on the the um the real helping and um charity thing <coughs> and we need fifty thousand us dollars so you know we're far off but it's not impossible and it's yeah, not man, too late yep. um i have received a lot of off the chart um people who has given us without being on the go fund not go for me on the real helping hand so you know some of the artists you know of course big up being a man big up bounty killer big up sizzler kalanchi they gave us the shows you know i want to thank them so much big up angeline little lenny big up the angel big up so it's not like and you hear you just heard tall man it's not like people don't reach out we have a lot of friends and family overseas who have been reaching out a lot of names to call uh, i want to big up mr um al <coughs> dos dr dos alfred dolls um who is seen her too dr june francis who is seen her too go through we had to take the port out of her because it was infected um some people are saying why is she in jamaica she started her treatment in the united states chemo and radiation and all other kind and it didn't work for her so we had to do something other than you know just sit yeah. down and watch her so we got into 
holistic with medical service to assist her and Jamaica That's is the place. Cheap. No, it's not cheap. Yeah. All right, so that thank works. you all.